Video Tai Chi 93 Breathing for Relaxation Tai Chi can be an exercise, a meditation, or a self-defense. Tai Chi can be you. Find a teacher, read a book, watch Video Tai Chi. Okay, today we're talking about uh, breathing for relaxation. I've been teaching several uh, breathing and relaxation courses and talking about the use of distraction for meditation. So, uh, the whole idea with distraction is that we have constantly have thoughts coming through our minds and we're trying to uh, try to figure out what this meditation thing is anyways. And really what meditation is, is finding methods for distracting, for focusing, creating a focus that will distract you away from thinking about the maelstrom of thoughts in order to give your mind the ability to rest, give your mind the ability to Take a breath, as it were. Um, so the, the types of ways we, th we think of to, uh, to distract the mind, uh, the first might, well, the first is to think about breathing as a, a part of meditation. And here, um, you can visualize yourself breathing into your, your tummy, into your abdomen. So as you, uh, and place your hand on your tummy as you're doing this, as you inhale, Visualize the air going into your tummy and filling your abdomen, expanding, allowing it to expand. And as you exhale, contract your tummy, pushing the air up with your diaphragm, up out of your lungs. So inhale, expand, and exhale, contract. Inhale, expand, exhale, contract. Now that's the easiest way to think about this breathing exercise. Um, and you can do that anywhere. You can do that while uh, waking up in the morning. You can do it while going to sleep at night. You can do it while driving down the highway or re uh, while reading a book just to generate in your mind a constant sense of relaxation, of calmness, of the ability to handle stress uh, or have stress totally disappear. Um, the next level is to visualize not just the abdomen expanding, but what is occurring with that breath as you inhale. So visualize this, a like a, a balloon that is filling with air or water as you inhale. The balloon expands and it drops. And that's what you want, what you want to visualize occurring in your abdomen is this expansion and dropping. Exhale. Inhale is the expansion and dropping. Exhale. Contraction and rising. Inhale. Exhale. Okay, so uh, that's another form, so another level of thinking about this. And so where I'm going with this is that as we distract ourselves with more and more levels of thought, of visualizations, the more we get distracted, the more we are, or the less, we are actually thinking about the daily problems, the, the where your next meal is coming from, uh, uh, what you're going to, when you're going to wash your laundry, uh, when you're going to pay your bills, when you're going to uh, go to the bank or the, the post office. All these things are constantly going through our minds. And meditation is a way of giving your mind a rest giving your mind a break from the constant stream of thoughts. And that's all meditation is. Um, so again, you have uh, one level is thinking about the expansion of the, the belly, expansion and contraction as you're uh, doing this. Um, uh, now another way of doing that is actually, uh, and this is a little bit more difficult, is actually as you inhale, contract the abdomen but still breathe down into the abdomen, but we'll get into that later. That's another, that's a deeper step, I believe. Um, so the, you have the inhale with the expansion of the, of the abdomen. You have the inhale visualizing a balloon filling in your abdomen as you inhale. And exhale. Now the next step would be to 
visualize, uh, th there is an area called the Dandien, which is two inches below your navel and two inches in. Uh, it's basically in the center of your lower torso. And this Dandien, or psychic center, is a place that you can visualize the air going in. The, 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 the energy, as it were, because Tai Chi and uh, Eastern philosophies, Eastern um, ideas deal with something called Qi, or Qi, or energy. Uh, and this, this Qi is constantly flowing, really, throughout the universe, but also throughout every human being. Um, and you're visualizing, perhaps, as, as, as your breath. Your breath is coming in, flowing into your body, going down into your Dandien on the inhale, and then on the exhale, flowing back out. Now, now let me show you a, a graphic picture of this. So as you are inhaling, the air is coming in, down to your Dandien, and here's your Dandien, this little circle or, or place in your lower uh, torso. And as you exhale, you visualize the air flowing up your spine, along the top of your head, to the roof of your mouth. Um, so the inhale, you're visualizing the air coming in along your, uh, your birth channel to your Dandien. And the exhale, you're visualizing the air going out your governing channel up along the top of your head, down to the tip of your tongue there. Um, and as, as you're doing this, you're, you're actually visualizing, so here, a picture of somebody sitting. Um, and the, they're visualizing the air on the inhale coming in and down to the Dandien. And on the exhale, coming up and exiting. Um, so you're, you're creating this, as we call it, a lesser cycle. Um, you're creating this lesser cycle to, to visualize, once again, this, this breathing method. Um, so we are, we are creating visualizations so that we are distracting our mind from uh, what we're doing. Um, we're, we're creating this distraction as a method of achieving meditation, which is what we're trying to do here achieve meditation so that you can give your mind a rest. Um, so the, the three things uh, that I want to review today are the just the abdominal breathing. So you're inhaling. You're not, you're not inhaling and allowing your chest to expand. You're, uh, what, what, when you go to a, a physical, which you should do once a year, um, you go into a physical and the doctor places his stethoscope on your chest and on your back and asks you to inhale. So naturally you go, <sighs> You're not supposed to cough there. Um, so as you inhale, you're using chest inhales. But really, for purposes of relaxation, the ideal is to use the abdominal breathing. So inhaling down and exhaling. Inhaling and exhaling. Or visualizing again into the balloon. Inhale and exhale. Inhale or exhale, and then again using the uh, the visualization as, as I showed with the green arrow, the inhale coming down to your lower dandien, and the exhale going back out all the way up around the top. Okay, um, now so those are levels of distraction, taking your mind away from your normal thoughts, and it works really well. Um, uh, the next level is then also to tie that into movements. When we do Tai Chi, we, we visualize doing all of these things as we're doing the movements too. So we're doing the movements. We're doing the uh, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. We're doing all these movements and also thinking about that cyclic breathing. Um, because that is, again, we're, we're taking yet another level of distraction, which is the learning the movements, and using that for meditation. Yes, Tai Chi is a martial art. Yes, Tai Chi uh, uh, is good exercise, but it's also an excellent way of developing uh, a meditational strategy. Um, 
So using movement, using the breathing, everything together helps to distract your mind and helps to relax. So again, this is uh, Alex Landefeld with Video Tai Chi, episode 93. Thank you.